Well, hello guys. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to the Big Fat Psychic channel. I'm so pleased to be reading again for you today. Okay, so, uh, oh my God, happy Easter uh, to everyone, okay? Uh, happy Easter indeed. So, uh, yeah, I, I've got the lives on uh, today uh, as well. So don't forget, uh, check out the looking back section of every video. Uh, and it is there with the date, so, okay, 17th of uh, April. Uh, and, uh, yeah, so I uh, hope to see you there. Make yourself known to me. Okay, and we'll have a lot of fun. Okay then, uh, so I'm going to look into uh, the Queen, okay, and this is from her mindset of anything, okay, it doesn't have to be uh, Harry, I'm hoping to, uh, you know, find out about her health, uh, maybe uh, the book as well, uh, that's, you know, a couple of uh, chapters uh, added, okay, so we did do the uh, public um, one on you know, was the public turning on our Queen, okay, you'll have to go look at it, it was interesting, uh, however, you know, I think uh, there is still uh, much love and always will be love uh, for our Majesty the Queen, uh, no matter what, okay, no matter what, uh, but yeah, uh, there is a couple out there uh, who, who want it, you know, want to see the demise of it, okay, anyway, go check it out, okay then, so uh, let's have a look then, been a bit worried about her uh, with her uh, mobility, okay, because you find that when one thing drops, something else drops, and then something else drops, you know what I mean, and it's just like, it's, uh, you'll hear it in people's voices when, when they say, oh, you know, she was never the same after that fall, you know, uh, she was never the same, so I kind of keep getting that through uh, my head, anyway, let's have a look. See. Right, okay, so let's have a look then. So what is uh, the truth of the situation uh, with the Queen? What's the truth of the situation? What's going on in her life at the moment, okay? Uh, what is it? What's the truth? So I'm getting that, uh, what's the truth of the situation regarding uh, the Queen, okay, so I think she uh, believes in herself uh, and that she can make something happen, okay, uh, and if she puts things, uh, she's been so sort of like putting things forward uh, and, you know, so success, she's looking for success. So it's believing in yourself, okay. I kind of see the two sticks there, all right, so um, regarding... This could be mobility, like an idea, you know, that where she could uh, be assisted walking or something. Okay, so uh, maybe she's looking uh, for something to work out that she knows it'll work if you just try it, kind of thing. Two of ones. Okay. I think she's trying to uh, work things out in like quite a few areas, okay. Uh, when I'm saying that, I'm seeing her walking, I'm seeing her going somewhere, I can see like a, I'd definitely see one of them uh, hand trolleys, you know, uh, you know, I think they're more modern. Maybe get a, maybe yeah, <laughs> like get some Wi-Fi or something, you know. <laughs> oh dear, that would surprise me. So that's the, the so the truth of the situation is she believes in herself and that she's healthy. Okay, uh, she really does. This is somebody who feels good uh, about oneself uh, as well. And when she's sharing ideas, okay, she's telling somebody something. Okay, so she's speaking to people uh, as well uh, and telling them uh, something. I mean, I, I don't know, we've never heard really, have we, what the actual problem is with the mobility, just that it was mobility. But I don't know, she would have uh, struggled uh, for breathing. I got that uh, before in her uh, readings, uh, before we knew she'd had COVID, okay. So, uh, yeah, I think uh, 
I've seen it happen to my dad. It's just not, honestly, it's just not the same person. I swear to God, he used to be out all over the place doing stuff, happy Larry, whatever, uh, and just like, uh, everything was going wrong. He went deaf, he couldn't, couldn't walk, he was having a, a passing out. Uh, what else was oh all sorts honestly the arthritis oh my god just overnight it just ballooned you know ballooned about 50 times the sizes of uh, Charles and I said to my dad how can you say that's normal you know that a doctor's told you that's normal and uh, he went well that's what he said I said well you didn't have arthritis uh, you know a couple of weeks ago uh, at, at any time in his you know it would creak on it don't just come like that anyway so yeah, it is bad for her. Right then, so uh, let's have a look then. So how is the Queen feeling? She got a lot there, didn't we? Uh, she's believing in herself. Yeah, she'll be. Uh, she thinks uh, something will pay off. What is it that will pay off, please? You know what is it? Do you know what? I kind of feel like a a hip a hip replacement. I felt it there, and now I've definitely seen it here. And it is, it's two hips, isn't it? Okay. Uh, so as my van one, holding on, holding on. I said I see two. It is. It's a hip. It's a hip. It is a hip. Um, so what has led to this then? What has led to it? Well, we know, don't we? The balance, in fact, in fact, I know that one. So, uh, yeah, it was a uh, balance. It, it, a hip is the problem. So what led up to uh, the hip being a problem? I freaking knew it. You know what? The other day I kept seeing hospital, hospital, hospital with the Queen. Uh, and I was wanting to ignore it. Because obviously, you don't like it, do you? To think that. Anyway, I think this is it. Yeah, she tripped. Okay, you got the full uh, uh She was probably on her way out the door. Okay. Uh, which door, I don't know. But I've, I've always said that about the door. Okay. Uh, and I'm getting that she uh, tripped over the carpet. I think I said before it was uneven. You know, because some of that where it comes to uh, especially older carpets over years and years and years, they're not always flat. They maybe have a little bit of a raised edge near the door joint. Yeah, that, that's where it uh, started from, okay. So, I imagine she's in a great deal of pain, you know. Uh, and I know she wouldn't want to take uh, extra strong painkillers because they're just that type, aren't they? Oh, no, don't take any tablets. It's the age group, I think, as well. So what is uh, the Queen's, uh, you know, intended actions uh, over the next uh, few weeks, okay, uh, the next few weeks? No, what, what's uh, the Queen's intended uh, actions, okay, uh, what is their actions going to be? So I, I feel like... Uh, Right, I find I feel it, Edward is going to be uh, it, it, doing something, and so is William. Okay, um, but I'm getting Edward. Has she got a brother? I kind of see uh, uh, an opportunity for uh, a man here uh, to to make uh, money. Okay. Don't know why I just felt like a. Uh, Edward. 
Oh, is he writing a book? Is he writing a, a, a book? Well, I see the opportunity there anyway. But, uh, yeah, I, I feel like this is uh, a trusted source, okay? A trustworthy person. Not Harry, uh, but uh, I think between them both, uh, I'm seeing, like, William and Edward. So is that the Queen then, you know, she's going to announce something uh, maybe uh, with him? Uh, so what, you know, what decisions will the Queen take, okay? Um, Regarding Harry and Meghan. For Harry and the Meghan, okay. So, I mean, they're always uh, attacking the royals, aren't they? Uh, they're always uh, trying to upstage uh, the royals. I think if it's uh, and ideas around her uh, health i'm getting you know continue effort here uh, for success but surely you know i mean with all the best doctors and everything couldn't they spot uh something going wrong with a hip maybe i mean i know they ain't got x-ray eyes but don't you don't you have to go for a full medical every 10 years or something I'm getting it. I don't like this because she, I'm getting hard work pays off. Hard work pays off, and that she's to continue the effort for uh, success. Well, it's hard work not saying anything. I think she's, uh, you know, like we saw in uh, the public, you know, we keep seeing her. Uh, like we see her as the payday to. Harry and Meghan having their life in California, you know, and slagging everybody off. So uh, I am getting something, decisions, okay. But I can't tell you that the decisions are not in uh, Harry and Meghan's uh, favour, okay. So I'm getting, like, as if uh, hard work pays off. But this could also be about the hip as well, okay. Maybe a treatment or something. You know, in this day and age, I've said it before, you know, you've got incredible uh, feats of uh, science, and yeah, and even going into space and all like that, yet yeah, they can't fucking make sure you're pain free for a 96 year old. I mean, it's just wrong. It's just wrong. I think as well, though, you know, the, the Queen could be sitting back to let others fucking attack uh, these two, okay? Um, yeah, I do. I feel like that. Okay, so uh, what does uh, the... So what's coming next for the Queen? What is coming next for the Queen? Yeah, you've got something big here, something big, okay, uh, and I feel like I'm just going to say just in time, just in time, okay, I don't know why, but uh, that's how I feel, like, it just coming in, so it's something, it's obviously something uh, good or big or, you know, it, it's, it's, you know, people will go, wow, 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 that's all we hear, wow, however, with the magician, you know, there's all, always a, an element of trickery here, okay? So where uh, it's not 
trickery as such but there is something there and i'm just gonna go uh just in time just in time Uh, so maybe it, that's to, to do with uh, the Jubilee as well, okay? Because uh, they seem to have been getting ready for it, don't they? Uh, but yeah. Oh, and it'll be soon. It'll be soon. It'll be so soon. It's coming soon now. Now, now, now. Okay. Uh, it, it's coming up. So how is uh, Madge feeling about her uh, uh, health then, okay? Well, she can't move, you know, that's the problem, isn't it? She can't move, okay? So uh, she's feeling uh, a bit trapped uh, and stuck, unable to, to move, so... Uh, I wonder if, uh, you know, Harry considered that when he went over just to check out, uh, see if she was nearly dead. What was that going to be then? So Megan could whisper in her fucking ear something evil. Ah, oh, Jesus, hey, and they would. They would. They would. Okay. So, yeah, I, I'm feeling this is all about uh, being uh, unable to move. I can hear it quietly. So, like, it's in disbelief, you know. Well, I can't move. What? what how come? Uh, you know, I, I can't move. And I don't mean that in a, a shocking, distressing uh, way. You know, it's like, it's like saying, for fuck's sake, you know, uh, how come I can't do this? Or you know, it's summer. It's just like a, a moan. Uh, so will uh, the Queen undergo surgery on a hip? Well, I'm getting a lot of a, a, a lot of differences of opinions here. Okay, uh, so there could be uh, medical staff could be so like arguing between themselves you know about what is really wrong or what the best solution is so people have put forward uh things to her uh, about what could be done okay i kind of feel as well that the queen wouldn't want to make a, a decision like this okay for some whatever reason i've no idea but it's not her that wants her to make this she, she needs she wants to get herself out of it but, you know, uh, is it that she wants to stay like this or she wants to get herself out of it and, and move forward, okay? So, I think uh, it, it's uh, as well about timing, okay? It's timing. Uh, so, you know, let's ask then, because this is what's bothering her the, the most, you know, okay? Uh, and I'm glad, really, it's more health than anything else, so... Uh, let's have a look then. So last card, I think. Last card. What's next for the Queen? Health-wise. Oh, well, uh, I'm not sure how to take this, okay? I really am not. Oh, dear. Well, I'm getting, a, a, you know, like something that's been hidden uh, for a while, okay? So not talked about. Um, and I'm, it's set to be uh, revealed. I don't feel it's personal, okay? Uh, personal. So maybe not, not disease, but, you know, maybe something to do with... Uh, that's all I'm going to say, you know, uh, uh, health as well. I don't know if somebody's going to come out and say she's been a bit blue. Well, you would get a bit, a bit blue. Uh, you've lost your fucking husband. You've got two terrible uh, grandkids-in-laws. Uh, you know, uh, you've got your sons all kicking off with their different uh, shit. Yeah, you know, of course you're going to be feeling uh, fucking uh, blue. But I'll tell you what, there's not worse than being in pain uh, and especially not being able to, to move freely. Because if you can't, you know, everything around your hip, uh, your back and everything, your neck even, is all connected. So, you know, it's restrictive all round.
what uh, what what's the hidden knowledge please what hidden knowledge will be revealed uh, about the queen Oh my god, I don't, this is Megan's card. This is Megan's card, okay? Okay, so uh, I just feel like... Um, I feel like words in a book, okay? Words in the book. I think th this could be as well. Uh, Camilla being attacked, okay? Uh, yeah, definitely. Uh, especially by uh, other women. Other women. Other fucking women. Can you believe it? Honest to God. Fucking horrible, yeah. Horrible. That's what my husband says on a Friday and Saturday night. <laughs> Talk to you like shit. <sighs> anyway, uh, so I'm getting like this is about uh, somebody who's been very destructive, okay? Uh, very destructive. And I'm getting unreliable as well. So they might fucking be talking about something, but they, they don't know what they're on about, okay? But I do see somebody saying something really, really uh, uh, spiteful, okay? So the secret to be revealed is uh, about somebody who is uh, vindictive and spiteful then, okay? Oh, as well, I mean, Megan's always saying she needs uh, help, help, help. You fucking do, my lovely. But anyway, uh, you know, it's not just about that. She's always got staff, 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 staff. I tell you, this is woman. This is it. This is it, okay? Uh, the, the news from the Queen is about Megan uh, being a right... See you, Auntie. Okay. See you next Tuesday for short. Okay. Uh, but yeah, I, I I absolutely do. I think uh, you know Megan's behaviour uh, is is a problem. Megan's behaviour is a problem uh, that is going to be revealed. How does uh, you know has uh, the Queen uh, come to a conclusion on uh, you know Mary Megan? Oh, Megan? Uh, yeah, Megan's uh, bullying claim. claim. Yeah, I think, uh, you know, this is uh, bad. This is bad, okay, because it's like things not going the rails way. You know, maybe there was hoping uh, HR could make up, uh, you know, a few excuses. Uh, maybe that it was uh, exaggerated by the victims or witnesses, okay? And it fucking wasn't. It isn't, you know. Uh, there's a, a seize here, a seize, seize to seize something, okay? Yeah, this is bad, okay. This is bad. This is bad. It's bad for Megan, okay. It's definitely bad for, for Megan. But like I told you before, as employers, you know, uh, they was responsible for the safety of their own fucking uh, staff. Uh, and especially when people have raised concerns, okay, uh, and failed to take action. Well, it's, uh, you know, it's, is it culpable or something? Okay, it's, they, they are fucking uh, responsible. So, yeah, it's not a good thing at all for the Royals or... Uh, indeed for Megan but do you know what I'll forgive the royals for their part uh, you know their stupidity because at the end of the day they wasn't used to anything uh, like that okay uh, they've never had any any some uh, member of staff that's been uh, you know horrible to other staff or uh, unprofessional or you know uh, aggressive abusive you know so they Unfortunately, you know, it took them fucking 70 years uh, to learn that. I mean, us, we, we're in a, what, start a job within a few weeks and you see all that, you know, so. Uh, but, yeah, so I don't feel like uh, it's gone well uh, for the Queen either. Well, do all you can. Do all you can. Do all you can. Anyway, so, uh, yeah, I'll do a, a read on uh, Megan's things there. Uh, Oh, in the next uh, day, so but yeah, keeping out. I am be. I I can't see anything. I ain't being able to see any videos of him walking around or out uh, and looking fucking miserable. However, uh, you know, it's I I I can imagine it is true because 
of the ways left things here. Okay. Uh, but yeah. Oh, Jesus. And here, fucking there. Well, I got that wrong, didn't I? Got that wrong, but never mind anyway. Who oh, gives a shit? She's there. Uh, you know, I hope, I hope she does stay because they have the two devil cards together. Next time I fucking see that, I will uh, no. But I should have known she, there was uh, uh, obsessed uh, t together. Okay. Um, and yeah, it was confusing with them fucking knowing they was going to England first. And I should have got that, but anyway. <laughs> okay, I'm not fucking super psychic. <gasps> right, anyway, guys, uh, have a great uh, Easter uh, day and just rest, bank, you know, bank holiday, whatever. Do what you want to do. Uh, make yourself happy. Uh, take time out for yourself, okay? Even if it's, if it's uh, 10 minutes. All right, guys, uh, been lovely uh, reading for you. I'll be back again soon. Bye now. Bye-bye.